we finally made it out to the field to fly our senior telemaster. Yeah, the trash can telemaster is finally finished. So you were starting this up by hand. Yep. You don't like to use any kind of electric starter on it. When I when I can avoid it, that's true. Uh, but this is such a good running engine now. Uh, it starts really <laughs> easy. And it didn't quit on us one time this whole day. Not a lightweight airplane. I make it look light right there, but that airplane is not light. surprised at, uh, like you'll notice in the video here, the, the run-up, I, I think I only get to about three-quarter throttle before the thing's off the ground. Uh, and, I'm, and I'm actually still advancing the throttle when the thing breaks ground. What were your thoughts on its flight characteristics, like with the first time you got it up in the air? Uh, it has plenty of power. Uh, I'm not worried about uh, getting out of danger. got me though that I was surprised with is how much fuel comes out of the overflow. Well, as you burn fuel down and reduce the volume in the tank, that goes away. If you're not listening to the podcast, uh, we, we also have a podcast, and uh, we go into pretty good detail on uh, what we had to do to this airplane. Um, so basically, the, the quick rundown is we salvaged this out of a trash can. That's why it's called the Trash Can Telemaster. And... Uh, yeah, made a few small repairs, and Ron recovered it in the in the colors you see here. Um, and uh, yeah, we've been uh, toying with this thing for said so, well, way too long for a while. flutter in the flaps. Uh, we can tighten up the linkages, maybe seal the hinge gaps. I think we'll be fine. Dragger, very, very squirrely. <laughs> yeah.
still, every time I see that shot, it does. Oh, you left that in. That's awesome. Uh-huh. It's interesting to see how little you move the controls to take off, except yeah. for the rudder. Yeah, I use a lot of rudder. Um, well, once again, tail dragger, you have to. But yeah, on the takeoff, um, which is odd usually for a tail dragger. Once the uh, once the tail is off the ground and you're and you're over that P factor, usually you have to add a little bit of right rudder to counteract the torque of the engine. But if you watch my takeoffs, it's mostly left rudder. 